Welcome back. This is still the Abdul Squad. We continue with the show. And like my co-host earlier on stated before we went on the break, we'll be talking to a very talented young man that knows how to handle backlash. He posted pictures. I was just like, listen, me, I was just trying to prove a point that we talk too much as Christians. Yeah. And I loved his response. I'm talking about the one and only Kampana Hanza Lama, the upper is so signed artist, the one and only Dizmo Kaneva Sevana. I won't be watching the territory. I will never territory. We in the building, that. we in the house. I love that. We in yeah. the house. I mean, I it. Yeah. You've had, yeah, you know, it's been great. Yeah. With the, my singles that you put out, one of the best, in fact, the lighter and Rizzler. Rizzler and the lighter. And, and the lighter. Yeah. Because usually Paul Holly, like on the Diamond Top 10, very far. Do you know Rizzler and the lighter? I've got this more. So they <laughs> seem to be enjoying that song a lot. But yeah. personally, in it, my favorite yeah. is Judgment Day. Oh, the uh, recent uh, the release. The recent release, because see, after listening to it, now I'm going to play some more. Because I started thinking about imagine if there's planes, <laughs> the shenanigans. If you have to step out, I'm a victim of fun of food. <laughs> ah, cool, four times too. You can, but what you, uh, you know what I mean. Most of but I want to know. Yeah. With the year that you've had, yeah. which of your design are proud of this year? I'm Church proud time. of uh, my growth uh, in terms of maturity, you know, and just I'm making music that is being appreciated by people who are way older than me, you know. Mm. That's the number one thing that I'm proud of, you know. I find myself in situations where I'm driving, then people, you know, when vehicles, you know, big people, ladies, men, they'll be like, yo, we love your music, you know. Like, I've shifted from that ground to the next level. Mm. Yeah. Okay. okay, now let's also talk about Rizla and the Lighter. Yeah. How did that collaboration come? How did you even think of it? I need to understand the oh. collaboration. Megan Zobo Bunch, how did it come to Okay, so me and MT, we've always had... Uh, um, had this relationship, you know, from the time I dropped Ghetto to my head, you know, because mm. I invited him to come through and perform at the album launch, you know. Yes, I remember that. Yeah, so we've been talking, you know, every time I want to drop a song, I'll send it through to him, he listened to it, mm -hmm. you know, we we'll talk like that. So the time they, they, they came in, in Zambia, you know, to perform, you know, I, I told him, like, yo, I have a song that I want you to jump on, you know. They was like, yo, pull up at the hotel. Then I got my studio equipment and went there. You know, the benefits of having your own studio equipment, car. Yeah. Cool stand up. Imagine now yeah. chatting yeah. to go higher. Yeah, so I went there, you know. He heard the song, he loved it, you know. We you know, he charged me a certain figure then. Um I wasn't really okay at that time, so Mark was around, you know, Makito. So, um, I talked to him to say, I want to do a song with this guy, and he's this, then he told me, you'll just talk to him, then I'll, I'll, I'll handle all that. That's when we worked on the song. Mm, okay, yeah. so that explains why you were saying, because I remember when the song was about to come out, Mwani yeah. Panganaka yeah. saying you appreciate him, so that's yeah. why that came from. Yeah, he's, he's a very generous man, you know, like, we need people like him in the industry, you know, like, if we had 10 people with hearts like him, the industry would be big, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Mm. Yeah. That's nice, but also, it's our season, we have the IIA, Kweteko, I'm a backlash, I race, I don't believe me. I want to thank you for what you, one of your, your good friends and the uh, apparently so entertainment that he wasn't even nominated. Oh, yeah, yeah. Mm, what do you have to say about that? Mm. But before that, I'm last, can I cut out Isaac Balain? Hello, good afternoon, Isaac. Hello, good afternoon. Yes, I'm not sure. We know the shine. We know. We know. Still, if we're still talking to Dismo, I find some entertainment assigned artist as well yeah. because he, he's doing amazing things. But we were talking about Ama Awards season Africa, you know, yeah. a lot of people have a lot of Ama Awards. But what do you have to say about such awards? Um, for me, I think they're just okay, you know. At the end of the day, we, we, we've stayed for quite some time without having any award ceremony, you know. 
So for someone to just decide, you know, to come up with an idea of awards, you know, it's it's a good thing, you know. Like people's work is being recognized like that, you know. It's just okay. Mm. Yeah. But also, I've, I've started telling your people. Let me tell you, I'm diamond TV. I'm going to go to the diamond TV. I'm going to go to the diamond TV. Ah, let's be serious. Let's, in fact, we're playing a promo. We are doing diamond TV personality. We are doing the diamond TV. We are doing the diamond submit. Yeah, my fans were. Now I'm going to switch to the car. Can we the diamond TV? No, it's not I don't mean I talk. So start telling your people to nominate you. No okay. Worry, no mm, worry. Because the closing date is soon. Pashani, I'm about 20. Eight, twenty eight, I think somewhere oh, there. Okay, but, uh, but also I want to understand when you were making the song um Judgment Day. Yeah. What was going through your mind with that song? Because that's I don't know what the case. It's such a, a beautiful spiritual song, but it's also very cautious in Okay, so um that song, you know, it wasn't really mine in the first place, you know. It's for 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 mm -hmm. that's Sedemanion's song, you know. Mm. Yeah, there's a guy. But that is a song I'm talking about. It, about it's called Judgment Day. I love, love this song. I already told you at yeah. the beginning. So you are telling me how this song came to be. Okay, so um, there's a guy featured. His name is Seremanio. You know, he's a dope guy. I've been featuring him. You know, in most of my songs. Mm. So there was a time when we were coming from a certain performance. You know, then he was like, "Yo, there's something that I want you to listen to." You know, then he played the song. I told him play it again. Then he played it again. Then I was like, I love this song. Let's let's redo it and you know shoot a video for it. Then I was like, I'll, I'll, I'll put you on this too. Then he agreed. That's when we worked on it and shot a video. Now, it. now with the video, you 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 put some state, some pictures out on your Facebook on yeah. on the status. That got some backlash. My yeah. chef and to to understand sometimes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, when you are putting out those pictures, did you expect such backlash? Yeah. I, I knew exactly what I was going to get from that because, you know, I was um, trying to play with people's minds like, yo, if, you know what I mean? <laughs> but then I came to the realization that, you know, people would actually judge you there and then without mm. even knowing what's mm. really happening, you know. And then I posted a, another post like uh, an hour or two explaining, after that, I explaining, saw explaining that. to say Why you did this that? is how things are supposed to be. And, then and I love the example that you used about the man with the phone rings in church. Yeah, you know what um, I mean. Yeah, yeah. So, um, what I know, you know, when people make mistakes in the society, you know, the reason why such people wouldn't even change, you know, it's because of how um, certain people actually look at them, you know, like, yo, what, whatever you are doing is wrong, you know. So, mm. with that feeling, they're even afraid of going to churches and stuff. That is so true. You know Sorry, I mean? we came to talk about Gordon on the line. Hello, Gordon Njovu. Yes, hello, Njovu and Gordon. Oh, okay. Go ahead with your contribution, boss. Yes, sir. Uh, it doesn't matter what people say about this more mouth. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> um, <laughs> ah, ah. You must go. Because I'm volume. Could see we have Gordon. I'm Tima Kambadionsi. 
Hey, Natosako, hey. Yes, come. Okay, okay. Uh, this more, never give up, my brother. Never give up, man. You are talking about you, satanic. Never give up. Continue, my brother. Thanks a lot. I appreciate. Okay, never give up, my bro. Okay, okay. Cheers. Good day in love. One okay, love. Okay, what is it? One love, one love. One love. <laughs> So that was good and coming to you. Just encouraging you. Continue. But you explaining to me that that's not how it's supposed to be. That's why yeah. you put out those pictures. Yeah, yeah. Did you get uh, um, the reaction that you wanted to get even when the song dropped? Um, not really, you know. Can I tell you something? Tell like, me. I, I, I didn't like even. Stories, eh? I didn't even know that the judgment day would be this big, you know, because I was like, let me just try and drop. You know, in most cases, I drop hip hop, you know, mm -hmm. like as my singles like that, you know, like it's rare for me to just come up with a commercial song and decide to release it just there and then, you know, mm -hmm. but the response was massive, you know, like numbers are crazy on YouTube, Spotify, yeah. you know. I'm proud of it. Yeah, I'm proud of it. Very much. So I didn't even expect such a reaction. You are just no, putting no. out the song because you like the song. Yeah, yeah. No, but that's what happens when the song is such a beautiful song, when it connects with people. But also, the, the video, who did the concept of the video, the storyline? Because... Uh, uh, Sami D. There's a guy called Sami D and uh, Kingston Kakin. Mm. You know, they are, they are very dope. They are actually the guys who shot Greatest. I don't know if you've watched the video. Mm. Yeah, they are, I work with them. They are good. So, everybody should have an idea to send to the song, you will fetch him, that I can come on his song. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I make a more now. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I love the fact, I don't know if that was intentional, because this is what we are seeing happening in the, in the community right now. We've seen a number of rape cases going up, a number yeah. of family cases going up. So, to see you touch on that, I feel like it's so great that as an artist, they're also using your voice to advocate for yeah, such. Yeah, so, um, you know what happens in most cases, you know, not everyone is, you know, making genuine money to feed mm. their families, you know. True. Now, imagine a situation where, for instance, maybe, you know, you steal from other people, maybe you are a hacker or something, you know, then your kids and, you know, your family, they don't know anything about that. All they know is that, you know, um, our dad works somewhere, you know, and then, you know, God is there trying to judge you, then your kids are watching what you used to do just to put food on the table, you know. Mm. That wouldn't be nice, you know what I mean? So that's the, the concept <laughs> behind the song, you know. We love it, yeah. but we have Peter on the line as well. Hello, good afternoon, Peter. Good afternoon. Go ahead with your contribution quickly. Yeah, come from a kind of lamb. Hey, we, we know, we know. Uh, uh, I love the way you say Selemanyo. <laughs> Selemanyo. Uh, cheers, cheers. You know, that, uh, that concept of your video. Yeah. You know, when I play this video with my friends, huh? Yeah. Yeah, they always, like, uh, give me that negative vibe because of the crucifix and everything. Yeah. But I feel, I feel it's because uh, the concept of that video is that people will crucify you, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, people will crucify you. Like you said, they will judge you upon just, like, uh, their first opinion of you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I don't know if that's what you meant by the crucifix and everything. Yeah, so um, crucifixion is just one of the punishment that, uh, you know, people used to use, like, a long time ago, you know? So you even... Have to, you have to carry your cross. Yeah, 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 you know what I mean. <laughs> so, like a Tambisha feeling. That's yeah. <laughs> uh, but otherwise, big ups, my G, all the way up. Thanks, I appreciate. All the way up, man. Keep yeah, I appreciate, up. I appreciate. You right, see, man, thank you so much, Peter, for that all the way from Cab. We are broken here. Now, Monica, the moon chain also. But, but also, before I let you go, we've seen that so is giving back to young talents. Yeah. Is this something that you're doing intentionally as well? So, should we expect more young talents to be coming up in Apari so? Yeah, so Jay is one, one uh, you know, he, he can see, like, when he looks at someone, you know, he's able to tell how a person can be in future, you know. So he, he picks like the correct people to work with, you know, because it's about patience, you know, and hard work, you know. So we will be signing a lot of young, talented cats, you know. Also, 
you gave us uh, Ghetto to Bayadzi. Should we expect another album from yeah, you? Yeah, there's an album being cooked. You don't know anything about that. Uh, tell us. There is a moon to moon to you know. Uh -huh. I wish I had my boombox here. I could have sampled for you uh, two songs or three. Uh, when likely is this going to be out? Before the year ends, you Before know. Before the year ends. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And lastly, before I, I I go, because me, I follow you very, very religiously like that. What has happened to our Tinta girl? Those pictures that circulated? Oh, yeah. So, um, that was a video shoot. Mm -hmm. that That's what day. I said. Yeah, eh? so it's, it's a video shoot, you know. At the end of the day, I can't be explaining to everyone, you know, mm. like, yo, it's a what, you know. Mm. Yeah, we were working on a music video, so some pictures circulated, you know. And I wonder why they couldn't post like the whole thing, you know. Cause, because the uh, judgment day. <laughs> you know, so, but it's cool, like, you know, I just watched that, you know, like people talking, posting, you know, and you know how social media is. I definitely know how social media is, but thank you so much, Dismo, for coming through today on the Abdul Squad. Remember, judgment day.